As the 2024 U.S. presidential election draws closer, all eyes are on the potential candidates who might shape the future of the nation. Among the most talked about are Vice President Kamala Harris and former President Donald Trump. Both are well-known political figures with strong supporters and critics. But the big question on everyone's mind is who's truly prepared to lead America in 2024? In this video, we'll take a closer look at Kamala Harris and Donald Trump to see who might be the best choice for the next president of the United States. Let's dive in and explore what each candidate brings to the table. But before starting the video, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Let's get into it. Kamala Harris's Political Journey Kamala Harris's political journey is a story of breaking barriers and making history. Born in Oakland, California, to immigrant parents from India and Jamaica, Kamala grew up in a diverse and vibrant community. She started her career as a prosecutor, working her way up to become the district attorney of San Francisco in 2004. In this role, she focused on fighting crime while also implementing innovative programs to reduce recidivism and give young offenders a second chance. In 2010, Kamala made history by becoming the first woman and first African American to be elected as the Attorney General of California. During her time as Attorney General, she took bold steps to protect consumers, fight human trafficking, and stand up for marriage equality. Or anyone at the White House ever asked or suggested that you open an investigation of anyone? Um, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Uh... Yes or no? Her leadership and tough stance on justice issues caught national attention and set the stage for her next big step. In 2016, Kamala was elected to the U.S. Senate, becoming the first South Asian American senator in U.S. history. As a senator, she quickly made a name for herself with her sharp questioning in Senate hearings and her advocacy for issues like health care, immigration reform, and criminal justice. Her experience and strong voice on key issues led to her being chosen as Joe Biden's running mate in the 2020 presidential election, making her the first female vice president and the highest ranking female official in U.S. history. As Vice President, Kamala Harris has focused on several important issues, including voting rights, immigration, and economic recovery. She has also traveled abroad to strengthen diplomatic relationships and represent the United States on the global stage. Her political journey reflects a commitment to justice, equality, and progress, making her a significant figure in American politics and a prominent candidate for the 2024 presidential race. Kamala Harris's political journey reflects a commitment to justice, equality, and progress, making her a significant figure in American politics and a prominent candidate for the 2024 presidential race. Her story is one of resilience, breaking barriers, and continuously pushing for change, which makes her journey truly inspiring. And now, as vice president, she has faced criticism for her handling of the border crisis and her perceived inaction on crucial issues. Some argue that her responses to these challenges have been inadequate and she hasn't taken enough decisive action. Kamala Harris is America's border czar. And how's our border doing, ladies and gentlemen? She hasn't talked to the chief of Border Patrol a single time in her entire tenure as Border Czar. Is this the track record of a leader ready to become Commander-in-Chief? As we look towards the 2024 election, these questions about her readiness and leadership will be at the forefront of the national debate. Donald Trump, a comparison. Now let's focus on the rival in the political showdown, Donald Trump. Trump's political journey has been nothing short of remarkable, characterized by his unconventional approach and his ability to energize a large base of supporters. As a businessman and television personality with no prior political experience, Trump shocked the world in 2016 when he won the U.S. presidential election. His victory was seen as a rejection of traditional political norms and a call for change for many Americans who felt left behind by the political establishment. 
During his four years in office, Trump made significant changes in several areas. He implemented major tax cuts aimed at boosting the economy and pursued a tough stance on immigration, including building sections of a wall along the U.S.-Mexico border. This is the most powerful and comprehensive border wall structure anywhere in the world. It's got technology that nobody would even believe between uh, sensors and cameras and everything else. Trump also reshaped the federal judiciary by appointing three Supreme Court justices and over 200 federal judges, significantly influencing the direction of U.S. legal decisions for years to come. The Trump administration has done more to shape the courts in just one term than any other president in recent history, a strategy that will affect the laws of the land for decades to come. Since taking office, Despite his achievements, Trump's presidency was not without controversy. He faced criticism for handling of the COVID-19 pandemic and was impeached twice by the House of Representatives. Still, his ability to rally his base and maintain a strong influence within the Republican Party has kept him in the political spotlight. As Trump gears up for the potential 2024 run, the question remains, is he ready to take on the role of Commander-in-Chief once again, or will his past controversies overshadow his bid for the presidency? The case against Kamala Harris. Critics argue that Kamala can sometimes appear too cautious and hesitant, especially when making tough decisions. These doubts have led some to wonder if she is fully prepared for the immense responsibilities of the presidency. Kamala Harris's leadership has been under constant scrutiny, particularly when it comes to her handling of key issues. For example, her approach to the border crisis, especially her response to the surge of migrants at the U.S.-Mexico border in early 2021, has been a major point of contention. Critics argue that her visit to the border in June 2021, months after being tasked by President Biden to address the situation, was too little too late. They believe her response has been slow and ineffective in curbing the influx of migrants and dealing with the humanitarian crisis. Extent to which the president has said Vice President Harris is in charge of the border. Vice President Harris said she was not in charge of the border. Uh, nobody seems to be in charge. She hasn't been there. And we have a humanitarian and national security crisis and, and health crisis unfolding there. Additionally, her perceived inaction on other crucial matters such as inflation and crime has led to growing discontent among her detractors. For instance, as inflation rates rose significantly in 2021 and 2022, some felt that Kamala, along with the administration, did not do enough to address the economic concerns of everyday Americans. With each perceived misstep, the voices of her critics grow louder. But I wonder what you say to voters who do want to go back when it comes to the economy specifically, because their groceries were less expensive, housing was more affordable when Donald Trump was president. They question whether she has the decisiveness and experience necessary to navigate the complex challenges that come with the highest office in the land. The real test for Kamala will be whether she can rise above this criticism and prove herself capable of leading the nation. Will she overcome these obstacles and demonstrate the strength needed to be commander-in-chief, or will these controversies define her political future? The case for Donald Trump. Despite all the controversies surrounding him, Donald Trump remains a powerful figure in American politics. His leadership style, bold policies, and unwavering base of supporters make him a formidable contender for the 2024 presidential race. For many of his followers, Trump represents a leader who is not afraid to speak his mind and challenge the status quo. They see him as someone who delivers on his promises and fights for what he believes in. Whether it's through tax cuts, tough immigration policies, or a strong stance on international trade. However, Trump's leadership has always been polarizing. His critics argue that his often divisive rhetoric and controversial policies have only served to deepen the divisions in America. They worry that a return to Trumpism could further escalate tensions and create more conflict within the country. Yet for his supporters, Trump's no-nonsense approach is exactly what the country needs in these turbulent times.
They believe that his willingness to take on the establishment and push through his agenda is a sign of strong leadership, not a step backward. The big question is whether Trump is the right leader to guide America through its current challenges. Can he unite a nation that is more divided than ever, or will his return to power only heighten those divisions? As we look ahead to the 2024 presidential election, the choice between Kamala Harris and Donald Trump presents a critical decision for the future of America. Both leaders bring their unique strengths and controversies to the table, and the stakes have never been higher. Who do you think is better suited to lead the nation? The choice isn't just between two candidates, it's between two very different visions for America's future. Kamala Harris, the historic first female vice president, is still proving her mettle and showing what she can bring to the highest office. On the other hand, Donald Trump, a controversial figure with a proven track record, has shown his ability to mobilize a strong base and push through bold policies. As the election looms, America must decide who's really ready to lead. What do you think? Is Kamala Harris ready for the presidency? Or does Donald Trump still hold the keys to America's future? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe for more political deep dives, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Your voice is essential in shaping the conversation, so join us and share your perspective today.